Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got a GT Online guide and tutorial. I'm sure you've seen the first lot of tutorials on the channel which I uploaded about a month ago. That came with the Lost Center Summer Special DLC. Um, Solomon's Movie Props. Now I did upload these like I said a month ago. The, them videos have exploded so much on the channel. Um, I did say in a comment that I did yesterday that I was going to do a updated or another version of that tutorial because a lot of people are still struggling even though it's been out a month it's been amazing how much that support has but yeah I want to try and do this as much as possible I'm hoping to help some people out the tutorial and method that I've got in this is exactly the same as the other one I just want to show more proof just to show people that there is no other methods that you can do this is honestly the best method that you can do but yeah, in this video we're doing movie props 1 to 7. Uh, movie props 8, 9 and 10, which I know a lot of you are hoping for. I will do them in a separate video, separately. But yeah, I have started a new character, this is why I've reset my rank. <clears throat> so yeah, I hope you guys do find this tutorial and guide helpful. I will get 8, 9 and 10 out the rest of the week, hopefully. And I hope these tutorials help you so much, like they did a month ago. And yeah, so once you are new to GT Online, um, GT Online, so for Movie Props 1 and 7, and you're new to Solomon's, you will get a message from Solomon saying that there's been a robbery at his studio. So that's pretty much the message you'll get. Also, on the map, you will get S for Solomon, so you can't miss the big S on the map. So this first bit is the introduction for it. So this is it. So it says recover the stolen movie props to earn cash and I'll pay you. Find and return them all to unlock the bonus reward. And you'll also get another message from him as well. All my priceless collector's pieces are gone. But yeah. Nothing much you can go from this point. All you gotta do is find the 10 props, which in this video I'm gonna do the first 7. So once you exit the office, luckily enough, the first prop, first prop for this is actually outside of his office. Which is right here, as you can see. Also, if you're on controller like PS4 and Xbox, um, you will feel a vibration on the controller, like I'm doing right now, as you get closer to it. Now again, these can be done, can confirmed, these can be done in a solo public lobby, any public lobby whatsoever, invite only, any sort of lobby really. There is plenty of tutorials out there if you want to do it solo without no one bothering you. Just go onto YouTube and you'll find tutorials on there. I'm sure there's a, a tutorial for each console such as PC, PS4 or Xbox, but yeah, you will get a vibration in the controller. And there's the first movie prop. So now it says return the movie prop to Solomon Richards, which is the big S, so again his office. And as you can see, we've just got $10,000 for that, which is a nice bit of money just for exiting the office and just easily finding it. But yeah, you can track how many movie props you've got. Because I know a lot of people ask me saying that they try delivering it, and it says a 9 out of 10 when they say they've got 10. But like I keep saying, if you go to your interaction manual, uh, pull up your interaction manual, you go to inventory and go to collectibles, you'll find movie props 1 out of 10 right there. So, but that's the first one. But I mean, we're just because we started off, that's bunch full of RP. But like I said, if you can collect all 10 this week, Rockstar's giving out 250k for finding them. So, but yeah. 250k is nice just for going around and finding props. So, this is the first part. This is prop 1, which was right near the dustbin over there. But yeah, let's move on to prop 2. So guys, time for uh, this is prop two. 
So prop 2, you will find prop 2 in the Vanilla Unicorn Strip Club in Strawberry, which is right here. Again, for me, it won't put on the map because I'm such a lower rank. But yeah, if you're a lower rank as well, you won't see it. So if you just come to my location right here in Strawberry, uh, yep, Vanilla Unicorn. Now, for this, I'm going to have to. To get into the back, you need to. Okay, now I've done this wrong. <laughs> so, what I suggest you do is. Start shooting inside. You will get police on you, but just call them. Um, just call Lester to call them back. To call them off. We need to go right through to the back in the premium lounge. Right to the back of the strip club. And again, you will feel another vibration. And it should be just in this office right here. There we go. And again, just call Lester. Which I don't have. Huh. So I might actually die here. But yeah. But yeah, I will cut this bit and I will play it once I've got rid of these cops and deliver the prop. Okay, so again, once you've collected the prop and you've escaped the cops, called Lester, give it to the big S as always. And yeah, that's prop two done. Boom. So yeah, you get 10k every time. So yep, yeah, that's two props out of ten. And always check your collectibles, making sure it is two out of ten. Okay, time to move on to prop three. So guys, for prop three, you will find prop three in the Casino, Diamond and Resort. So, yeah, which I think everyone will know by now where it is. But if you don't, it is literally right here. So again, like me, you will go for a tutorial. But, and you'll find the prop free in the bathroom. In the restroom. So you need to go right to the back here. Um, I think it was take a right here. Yep, you go right round here. Till you find the restrooms. And as you can see, as soon as you enter the door, you will feel a vibration. And you'll find it right at the very end, right here. And that's it. We just got to pop free. And just return it to Solomon. So again, once you've arrived at Solomon's office, just simply, as always, just deliver the prop to get your reward. Boom. Nice. There we go. Pop 3 out of 10 move pops returned. As always, just double check your inventory collectibles. 3 out of 10. Good. And time to move on to prop 4. Okay, so for prop number 4. Leave the area now. This is for authorized personnel only. So for prop number 4. So yeah, for prop number four, you'll find it in Fort Zancudo. Now, if you go from my point on the map, so if you go along this track here, so if you go along the motorway and along here, 
I will show you where it is. But if you're already on the hangar in Fort San Cudo, part of the Smuggler's Run DLC, then cops will not bother you. But if you're new, and they will, t they will put a star on you. So, my best bet is registers of VIP. And it's going to cost you 25 grand, but. And then just bribe the authorities. Or 15 grand, sorry. Bribe the authorities, you've got two minutes. Sir, leave the area now! So, he will say that, but um, if I can remember where it was, I think, from memory, yeah, I know where it is, sorry. So you go along this bit, and I think. Yeah, it's right here, sorry. So it's right here in the Tower 1. So Vok Zancuda Tower 1. Again, you will feel a vibration again. So it should be this one right here. And boom, that's it. Normal, just simply deliver it. Nice. Time to move on to Prop 5. So guys, once you've collected up to Prop 4, for Prop 5, you will find Prop 5 in Sandy Shores. So, if you look on the map, and you go to this area in the map, right to this location right here. So, right here. And you'll see, like, the alien hill bit here. I don't know what this is actually called, but I'm sure you can't miss it. And you need to go right to the very top, and you'll find the alien head, which is right here. Collect that. If I can. There we go. Boom. There you go. So that's where Prop 5 is. And there we go, there's prop 5 delivered. So we're halfway there now. Again for prop 8, 9 and 10, I will do separate videos for them. So stay tuned for them, I want to try and be as much detail and as possible basically. Right, so we've got two more props to go, let's move on to prop 6. So for Prop 6 on your map, you will need to go to this specific location right here on the map. So zoom out right here, so it's in Grand Sonora Desert. So you're going to... So where the arm wrestling thing is, and you're going to go along this road right here, just up to this point here where it goes off like this. So it's just actually going to be in this house right here. And as you can see right here... This is a prop that you want. There we go. So that's the location for prop number six. And there we go. Prop six has been delivered.
And time to f time to collect the final and last prop, which is movie prop number seven. So guys, for the very last movie prop, you'll find it in the um, the camp, which is here in the Chiliad State Wilderness. So just kill all the people there. And if you go right to the very back of the camp, you will find the movie prop on the rock right here. So as you can see, right here. There we go. And there you have it. That's the where the final location for movie prop number seven is. So once you've managed to escape the camp for prop number seven, deliver it to Solomon, and that should be up to seven props out of ten collected and delivered. So as you can see, prop returns seven out of ten. So in the next video, um, in the next three videos, we'll be doing, I will be doing prop eight, nine, and ten. They're all going to be separate videos. Um, again, I hope you found this video um, helpful and useful. And I've tried to provide as much detail as I possibly could. But I hope you guys do eventually find all 10 props for those who are struggling. Again, I'm sorry if this video is slightly a bit longer than I thought it would be. But I will try to keep it... I will try and keep it short as possible. But yeah, I will try and get Prop 8, 9 and 10 out. Um, if you did enjoy the video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, turn the notifications on. And again, like I said, I will try and get Prop 8, 9 and 10 out this week. See you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video.